When I was a little kid, I had a book on the saints that I enjoyed reading. One of the entries was St. Lawrence, whose feast we celebrate today. St. Lawrence was a deacon who was caught up in the persecution of the Roman Emperor Valerian. Two particular incidents from Lawrence's story stick out in my memory. One has to do with the prefect of Rome demanding that Lawrence turn over the treasury of the Roman church. Lawrence asked for a few days to gather it all up and managed to disperse most of it to the poor. Then, directed by the prefect to produce the wealth, St. Lawrence led in the poor and the crippled and the blind, stating that these poor folks were the real treasures of the church. The prefect, of course, was not amused that he had been tricked and ordered the martyrdom of Lawrence by having him burned to death on a gridiron. It was a slow and agonizing death during which the second incident was recorded as St. Lawrence exclaiming partway through his ordeal, I have well done on this side, turn me over. We cannot be sure whether these stories are true, but they capture some fundamental truths of our faith. One is the fact that people, particularly the poor, are the true wealth of the church. They are the ones who realize, perhaps better than the wealthy, just how much they rely on God for their existence and care. Our present Pope, Francis, certainly appreciates the wealth of the poor. The story of St. Lawrence's death seems less likely to be factual, but nevertheless, it is rich in value, for it captures the sense of humor and the attitude of the Christian faithful. For the true disciple, placing even one's life in proper perspective and facing death with a sense of humor is essential. Both of today's readings teach these values, but in different ways. Like Jesus, who laid down his life for us, St. Lawrence is rich in virtue and generosity as he faced martyrdom with a realization that this life is not the be-all and end-all of existence. Going on to be with the Lord is the real treasure.